Originally I started off producing oysters primarily for export to the French market. We, we got fed up with selling our oysters in bulk to France and not getting a great price. So I talked my wife uh, into turning the downstairs of our house here in Dundrum into, into a shellfish bar that I assured her would only be open for the summertime. The first week we opened, uh, we were booked out solid and it slowly turned into a, a seafood restaurant. A year down the line, we then decided we needed another outlet in Belfast, so we opened up the Morn Seafood Bar in Belfast. An average week between Belfast and Dundrum, in, in the summertime, we could sell anywhere up to a thousand and a half oysters a week. Now, everybody sort of worry about how do you open an oyster. Um, what you do basically is put them on a flat table, get your oyster knife, place it in the back of the oyster, fold your cloth over so it's not gonna impale your hand, and just lean on the oyster and pop it. Then you run your knife along the top of the oyster. Just to undo the shell. And that there is the most perfect oyster. When we were actually doing the building work in the restaurant in Belfast, it's located next door to Kelly's Cellars. And when we dug down, we found hundreds and hundreds of, of old oyster shells. So you can imagine them coming out of Kelly's Cellars in, in the 1700s, 1800s, having their oysters and throwing the shells away. The species of oyster we grow is the Pacific oyster. This oyster here will be approximately 100, 120 grams, which is the size of oyster we would use in our restaurants. And this oyster would be anything between 18 months and, and two and a half years old. Every day we'll offer on our oyster menu, oysters au natural, of course. Uh, oysters with garlic breadcrumbs and herbs, oysters with parmesan and bacon, chili jam or we'll have the Bloody Mary oysters in a, in a cocktail glass. Oysters are, are, because they're raw shellfish, so they're very closely regulated. So if you're going to your fishmonger in Ireland, uh, you need to ask them where they're from and you need to check with them that they're being purified. If you're eating on the continent, I would be very, very worried. You would really need to see all the documentation with the oyster or you need to go somewhere that's famous for oysters or shellfish. But you, you really need to, to proceed with caution.